Simply Southern is produced by the Alabama Farmers Federation and made possible with the support of Alabama Farmers Cooperative. What one thing can you say about your local quality co-op store? You can trust us. You get what you need for your farm, for your lawn and garden, and the safest products for your pets. We're locally owned and operated, and you can trust that we care about our community and the people in it. So if you're a raised bed gardener, a rose gardener, or if you farm hundreds of acres, the Quality Co-op Store has exactly what you need to get the job done. All this plus friendly, knowledgeable advice. Your Quality Co-op Store. There's one near you. What sustains us? Food? Family? Faith? Alabama farmers live those things every day. They conserve our resources, clothe our families, and fill our tables. They cultivate jobs for our communities and values for our future. Farmers grow it all right here in Alabama. Hello and welcome to Simply Southern. I'm Kevin Worthington. And I'm Mary Wilson. COVID changed a lot of people's lives. When a Montgomery woman couldn't go to work, she found a way to help people in her community while staying at a safe social distance. It may not be the time of year that many folks think of going to the farmer's market, but there are still opportunities to eat fresh vegetables, even during the cooler months. We'll see what Sweet Grown Alabama has on the menu for this time of year. And I'm Stacy Little. Today in the kitchen, I'm showing you two secrets to make perfectly crispy, crunchy chicken tenders. Y'all stay tuned. One definition of the word enterprise is a readiness to embark on new ventures. That's also a perfect description for the town and people of Enterprise Alabama. Well, in the 1900s, the boll weevil devastated the U.S. cotton crop, causing farmers to try something new. In southeast Alabama, that was peanuts. Today, the optimism and ingenuity of people in Enterprise are still going strong. Melissa Bowman shows us what makes this place so unbelievable. According to 1950s Hollywood, just when you think everything is okay, giant bugs could attack. But what those old movies didn't take into account was a town-like enterprise. An actual insect invasion that once threatened this town's economy was no match for its resilience. We are the only city that has a monument dedicated to a pest. It was put downtown over 100 years ago by the citizens of Enterprise to tell the story of what happened when the bow weevil was headed our way to wipe out the cotton crop. The citizens sought advice with Dr. George Washington Carver he was going through towns telling people that they needed to diversify their crops. So they took a leap of faith and planted the first peanut crop. Well, when they did that, our city prospered um, and they learned um, a great lesson that you could triumph over adversity. So everywhere you look, there's just a little bit of weevil in everything we do. Today, Enterprise continues to observe the bull weevil's place in its history in a number of ways, some that are very creative including an insect installation known as Weevil Way. We celebrated the Bow Weevil Centennial uh, back in 2019. And when we were talking about how to really get the new generation to better understand and, and get the message of the Bow Weevil Monument, we thought, well, why not with a public art project? And so uh, we partnered with Replica Plastics to see if we could create something that would be fun and whimsical that our businesses could display and so began Weevil Way. Today, nearly 30 statues are displayed around Enterprise. A website, weevilway.com, features a downloadable trail card that guides sightseers to each destination. Replica Plastics ensures that every Weevil they design has its own distinct personality that reflects the business it represents. We have what's called an imagination session and we just kind of talk through what they would see their bow weevil um, look like. Our artists do concept sketches. Once we finish production, our team installs them, and then we do fun unveilings. Weevil Way has not only been a hit with locals, it's also drawn visitors from near and far, many eager to snap selfies with these VIBs, very important bugs. Some weevils have even achieved celebrity status. 
He has his own Facebook page and is really, really just having an, an enjoyable time. People are watching his adventures. Weevil Way is a fun attraction that has generated plenty of buzz around Enterprise, but city leaders hope it also leaves visitors with a better understanding of this town's vibrant spirit. We are a town that has suffered through tragedy, but we have um, risen above it. We feel like if you'll come visit Weevil Way, we promise you that you will weave a little happier. For Simply Southern, I'm Melissa Bowman. You know, it's not every day that you get asked to create a giant replica of a bug. True. Jenny Hendricks with Replica Plastics said she enjoyed researching the boll weevil and figuring out how to make the statues as real to life as possible. Now, even though each weevil has its fun, whimsical side, they're also anatomically correct. Like the pattern on their back. That is the pattern that's on the back of a real boll weevil. And if you want to start your own boll weevil adventure, find a downloadable trail card online at weevilway.com. What did you do during the pandemic? One woman decided to take up gardening and her harvest is helping others while spreading joy. An Alpha Life Insurance policy provides financial security and peace of mind for those you love. Life insurance gets more expensive with age, so getting a policy earlier in life can potentially lock in a lower rate. Good eating habits and regular exercise can also contribute to a lower rate. Check to see if you can save money by paying your premium annually, semi-annually, or quarterly. Call your Alpha agent to determine the right life insurance for you. These Alpha Insights are proudly presented by Alpha Insurance. Alabama is a state filled with riches, like the juiciest peaches, a summer tomato sandwich, or grandma's pecan pie. But perhaps our greatest treasures are the hands that grow. From generations past through the years to come, Alabama fruit and vegetable growers produce an abundance we all enjoy. Alabama produce. It just tastes better. No matter the herd you tend to, or the type of seeds you sow, Farm Bureau Bank understands the lifestyle and financial needs of our neighbors. We're here to help grow traditions give back to agricultural communities, and offer financial convenience for your unique way of life. Whether it's personal or business, we are committed to serving you and your financial needs. Please give us a call and we'll get started today. A farmer has to live on faith. We do all we can do, but we can only control so much. Alabama is the second largest poultry growing state in the nation, so we're trying our best to grow all the corn we can for that. What we produce not only feeds and clothes all of the United States, but about half of what we make goes on to the world market. We've been able to improve yields, have some things that, that can help us produce a better crop. I'm proud of the product we make and proud that I can say I'm an Alabama farmer. When you look around for information and answers to your everyday questions, how do you know who to trust? Alabama Extension takes Auburn and Alabama A&M universities to the people. As educators, we are trusted partners in every county, providing valuable and practical ways to better our homes, farms, health, and communities. Our research extends knowledge and improves lives. Learn more at aces.edu.